Hey guys, welcome back to BJ Tech News, episode 33. So today's episode hopefully is going to be short and simple. I'm going to show you guys how to retrieve or look into what policies are being pushed out to the machine. Um, this is mostly an IT thing. Uh, it's a, a cool little trick. I'm going to show you how to use the GUI, the GUI, and I'm also how, I'm going to show you the two commands that you could use um, if you guys are really techy and want to use commands and impress people. Uh, show you the two commands that you can use in command prompt. So, I don't really have a lot of group policies pushed out to my machines, but uh, I'm going to show you how to get this stuff. So, if you go to start, and if you, with any new machine, you go to start, you either type it in here, or if you have a run command, you can do it there. I'm going to do it on the run command, and I'm going to do RSOP dot MSC. So, what that stands for is result. I think it's resultant set of policies, okay? And it's it's a cool little feature within all the Windows machines, all the Windows platforms basically that you can run, and it gives you a rundown of what um, policies are being pushed out to the machine. Most likely, if you have policies pushed out to, let's say, the event, it would tell you the source right here. It will give you the, the identification of where or what's the name of the source GPO that the machine is getting hit to. Um, again, I don't really have too many group policies being hit to my Active Directory, so the you won't see a lot. But again, the command is rsop.msc. Again, you can actually do it start. And if you guys are doing a Windows 7 machine, you can actually type it here. and it, it will search it and you just click on it it loads it up depending on how many group policies you guys have it would take a while for it to load up now if you guys really like command stuff if you like to be real techy and impress the people that you are troubleshooting um, you could do a run as command prompt run as uh, administrator command prompt and uh, I basically did a CD to go into uh, the root of the C drive I'm going to do a CLS to to clear it. My mind is not too sharp, so I forgive me for that. The two commands that you can basically do is GP result for slash scope user slash V. V is for Vbros, I believe. And another one is GP result scope computer. So if you want to know what GPOs are being hit by the user side, I'm going to copy that, paste it. That's the command that you would do. And it will run, and it will give you a run now. Okay, I believe if you do a greater than sign and forward it to like a text file, I think it does that. Let's see if we could do that with the computer. So what I mean is, you do this, do this, and let's go GP text. I don't know if it's gonna do it. Bam. And if I go to Oh, I don't know if I did it because I did not. There it goes. There it goes. The, the way I should have done it should have been like this. I should have done it like this because then that's giving it the pass. But it's a little smart because I am on the C, the C drive, the root of the C drive. It's right here. And that's it. This is basically a rundown of what group policies are being hit on the computer level. And that's about it, guys. That's real short, real simple. How to get, how to retrieve uh, the group policies that you, your machine is being hit. And once again, hopefully you guys enjoy the video. Please comment. Please subscribe. Also, if you guys have Twitter, follow me at BJ Tech News and check out my blog with more tips and tricks and the latest uh, hardware and software um, blogs at uh, BJTechNews.WordPress.com. And thank you, guys. Check you out later.